Well, good day, YouTubers, friends, and family from across the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew, Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on February 11th, 2019. Welcome to another surviving day on this planet, and welcome to another video from Morning Dew. Checking out some video images of a meteorite strike in Venezuela. That's right. Many people spotted this and happened to capture it on their cameras. These are the images coming out of Venezuela as a huge meteorite struck. Wow, some amazing images. And there's been a lot more meteorite strikes recently. Maybe that's because there's more phones out recording them, I don't know. But there's definitely an increase in meteorite uh, sightings. Of course, and look at these images, wow. turned green at one point. Look at that. There's a couple other ones where it showed uh, it making a turn. Now, I don't even know if that's possible. I can't find that footage anymore, but man, oh man, I just wanted to share these images with you guys. And it even started a huge fire here you can see video footage shortly thereafter impact and look at this fire that lit up the whole field and you can see there's piles of dirt and all sorts of things that are on fire there wow so while that's going on we've got a very busy sun as well we're going to look at images here from the solar dynamics observatory looking at a large coronal hole as well as a sunspot creation right in the top part of the coronal hole some instability rising as well as a sunspot region in the northern hemisphere we have a departing sunspot and also an incoming sunspot very busy sun everything but a filament eruption but look at this creation of the, the sunspot right there looking at another light here you can really see the curl and a coil in there watching the top right side there's a large tornado that has finally calmed down that thing raged for five days that's right a solar tornado that lasted for five days lots of energy coming on the left side there you can see a sunspot region coming in and it does look fiery so stay aware and prepared and thank you all for watching morning dew daily events worldwide and welcome to all the new subscribers from around the world now 6,000 almost 6,100 subscribers and I want to thank you all so much you guys are awesome I love doing what I'm doing and I love what you guys are doing too getting in that comment section hitting that like button subscribing hitting the notification bell so you don't miss an update I see lots of people when I upload they're hitting up that video right away I really love that and the community is amazing thank you all so we're gonna get to the five-day forecast here brought to you by Meteor Earth and Meteor Mike looking at a very snowy and wet Washington BC coastline a lot of action and snow even avalanche warnings in Washington Oregon as that as I predicted days ago in my video those low pressure systems are coming straight from the north now and they are cold and they're bringing a lot of moisture as well we have an atmospheric river event from the Pacific as that high pressure that turned into a low pressure system is now hammering and then still we've got a large low pressure system over Russia and it just forms every other day it's there just this monstrous storm day after day look at this thing Wow head straight towards our new North Pole over Russia that's right our North Pole has moved so much just do your own research folks look it up there's big-time movement right now 
and I believe we're on the pole, on the verge of a pole flip. Looking around the world, all higher elevations, very cold and a lot of snow. Australia, that storm is finally gone, but we do have a cyclone developing over the Fiji Islands, as well as that other low pressure system over Vanuatu, now heading south, but just missed Vanu Vanuatu Islands. But this is gonna be a pretty big one too, right beside Fiji, New Caledonia. atmospheric compression event our equator is being squished hence we have all the warmer temperatures spreading our equator it's not global warming folks it's a cycle looking over south america torrential downpours mass evaporation we're looking at it day after day here There will be flood warnings coming out of South America soon, if that keeps up. Looking over eastern Canada, we've got nor'easter, and that will be a pretty big storm to talk about. There will be a lot of rain and freezing rain on the backside with snow. Here in Alberta, we're looking at a small clipper forming later next week, so we will be getting some snow with the development of that. Most of Europe is in a high pressure ridge, cold but dry, and Russia is cold and very snowy. Completely covered in snow, helping to cool down even further the Northern Hemisphere. So stay aware and prepared, we're only in February, we still have at least five to six weeks of this winter weather, and we're still watching these large systems roll across the Pacific Ocean. Watch for a winter hurricane condition. Last 24 hours for earthquakes, there was a 4.1 earthquake reported here in Port Hardy, Canada, 10 kilometer depth, 189 kilometers west of Port Hardy. So off to the shores, off of the shores, but still a 4.1, that's the largest earthquake in this area for about a week or a couple weeks actually. Also a 4.9 in Russia. 136 kilometer depth in Japan the Izu Islands are here. and as well small Indonesia 4.6 5.0 as well in Hai Hai Fo Tonga at a 10 kilometer depth in South America though a lot of action since the 5.3 in Honduras yesterday Dominican Republic still on an earthquake swarm so still our quiet region, the subduction zone, small release with a 4.1 earthquake. But you can see here, it's still a very quiet zone when you look at the last seven days for earthquakes from around the world. 4.1 right there in Port Hardy, Canada. All my friends and family, please stay aware and prepared. Things are changing drastically. Our, our Pole, North Pole has moved so much that scientists around the world are posting it and they are concerned. They weren't supposed to release data until 2020, but they felt that it was super relevant that they release it now. So please stay aware and prepared. Thanks for watching today. Stay young and have fun and get your morning due. Bye bye. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.